Today on Happy Hour, Barack Obama's coming to Hillary Clinton's home turf. So what's the plan? J. Charles Johnson, New York campaign finance advisor to Obama, takes a seat at the bar. Plus, playing games and taking calls. That's coming soon for you PSP owners. The CEO of Skype joins us from the Consumer Electronics Show in Vegas. And she breaks down common everyday phrases. Internet philologist Marina Hot for Words explains it all. This and more today from the Bull and Bear at the Waldorf Astoria Hotel. Well, did you ever wonder where the phrase happy hour came from? Or how about bull and bear? Well, we asked the word expert on tap next. It's happy hour, everybody. It's time now to throw back a few quick shots with our special guests, Bill Schultz in the house from Red Eye. Red Eye! Yay! And Love Marina, that show. hot for words. That's not really your last name. That's, I think, your website. Yeah. What's your actual website? My website is www.hotforwords.com. All right, we're going to talk more about some. But it's uh, actually a YouTube channel, later. number one on YouTube. You gotta love that. Yeah. All right. You went to quick shot. Philology all around. Now, YouTube is an internet destination. <laughs> yes, okay. it's an internet destination. Yeah. <laughs> I think somebody bought it recently. Whatever will happen to the Hollywood egos if they can't get stroked during the 237 award shows this year? Year. We'll soon find out as this year's Golden Globes is apparently going to be more of a news show than our show Happy Hour on Fox Biz. What do you make of that? <laughs> <laughs> Bill? I've been boycotting the Golden Globes for years now until they start recognizing programming like Happy Hour or Red Eye with Greg <laughs> Gutfeld, for example, or Pants Off, Dance Off. I'm not going to watch. Pants yeah. Off, Dance Off. I missed it's, that one. But oh, you guys watch me. Why, why, do, why do you care about Golden Globe? Because I like, <laughs> personally, I like to see all the nice dresses. I mean, it's more of a oh, fashion show yeah. than anything else, right? I, I actually have nice that? dresses, too, in my channel. That's what I'm saying. You just gave me a great idea. They totally need to make the YouTube I, Golden Globes, the YouTube Globes. And then they could have a whole awards well, benefit have, like the Silicon Valley. The you're going to have, 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 have the beautiful Miss Hot for Words. Hot for Words can be hot. Try it. Give it a shot. Uh, hey, I'm always thinking new internet it's businesses. A million dollar Seed idea. planted. I know Seed what it planted. Means. You guys know what Golden it means. Golden Globes? No, philology, dear. But you're an expert on Of course on I know. My mother's an English teacher. We're coming back. You've got to be funny in a minute. Hold on. Okay, here's my quick shot. The mayor of Arlington, Oregon, is telling her small town residents to, you know what, get over it, folks. Get over the uproar from pictures found on her MySpace page in which she's posing in black underwear on the town's fire engine. Now, that's I don't think that mayor. picture did her justice there, but uh, yeah. Look. Not the best lighting. No. But uh, look, I, they're saying this is affecting her job. I mean, I think it was very tasteful. For example, like Cody's got some stunning pictures of him in a strapless ball gown on Have his MySpace page. Have you seen my yeah. and, DeGeneres? And if anything, it helped yeah. you. That looks, that, yeah, that does look vaguely lesbian there. But, um, <laughs> yep, see that? But look at me, Bill. I look smoking. Yeah, you do I look smoking. I, I wish yeah. I really looked like that in person. <laughs> I wish they, they didn't include the Aruba tan, though. I'm a little upset about that. <laughs> yeah, we'll just shade it in a little with some uh, coffee grinds. And yeah, why not? Coffee <laughs> grinds. <laughs> Okay, well, Marina, we want to talk about now what the you, the lala yeah, 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 la 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 so philology, let's what talk does it about mean? it. What does it mean? Actually, it's uh, the study of origins of the words, and when you go uh, behind the history of the word, and philology comes from two Greek words, philos, which means love, uh -huh. and logos, which means words. So philology is the love for the words. You're like And a, I'm hot for words. You're like a beautiful William Sapphire. I'm actually more beautiful. New York Times. Yeah, more beautiful <laughs> yeah, than... Yeah, you're yeah, definitely so. more beautiful you than you. You could be okay, talking about being hot hour. for toasters right now. I'd still be paying attention. Yeah, that was where <laughs> happy hour uh, so came from, Marina. Toastology. What is the there you uh, go. background of happy hour? How did that word come about actually, in our uh, vocabulary? That's a good question. Good question. Happy hour was originally a slang for a Navy term. And um, it started out in around 
in the 1920s uh -huh. for on ship performances. And happy actually referred to someone being slightly drunk, tipsy. And so. And then it was carried over to the prohibition days when it was illegal to drink. Like you cannot drink in the restaurant. Right. They, they, they didn't serve the sort of like alcohol. Us. We can't drink in the restaurant. No, look, we look, can't look, drink here, Marina. Yeah, look around. Well, yeah. commercial. Well, we can. Everybody we else can. can. Maybe you okay, guys. Okay, what about so, people? And bear? Bull and bear. Uh, bull and bear. Okay, the word. I think the word bear appeared first, and it was um, referred to people who actually sold bear skin before they killed the bears. Bear skin. I thought bear so was like a hairy homosexual. You're like selling a head before you exactly. own it. It's like shorting a stock. And the bull market appeared after as an opposite to the bear market. Marina, you can say anything you want on your YouTube with you dressed in those skimpy outfits, as gorgeous as you are. People don't care what you're saying. Because they but, like but, my school. But, but because they love you. But it, it's good. You caught, you caught on to something that's kind of fun as it well, It is though. fun. You got a whole yeah. But do you, do you guys have, a, like, did you have teacher before at school that you would make sure you never miss the class. Well, my mother is well, the high school you senior look, English teacher. If the teachers teacher look school, like you, and if all, and if the male <laughs> teachers look like Brian Hicks, our market segment guest, then yeah, we would all be watching. So, so my students never miss my classes. They never come not. back. I bet not. That's and they learn. They learn the internet. Oh, oh, Bill, you he Bill's here stunning. too. Oh, Bill. Hey, no, please let her go. I'm, Are you going to be my fine. student also? Bill, where does the where, I've been what's very the naughty. origin of the Marina? word red eye? Yeah. Red eye. I believe it is a cocktail featuring eggs and human blood. Oh my God. <laughs> little vodka on top yeah. for the Russian. All right, on tap next, our corporate greed and fat cat egos getting in the way of helping kids. The one laptop per child charity controversy on tap next. It's happy hour, everybody.